Okay, welcome back. So one final, final piece. I know I keep changing things, but one final piece to the puzzle, and that is the simplicity of this door. While I do like the Dark Forces look, I feel like, I feel like there can be more. So the door is down. Um, that's the extra piece of wood on the back end. And that is to make it so that the gear wouldn't need to be cut and the whole auto slide would work properly. Otherwise, I would have to move the auto slide to a place where it would have been in front of a stud and that wouldn't have worked. So this worked out perfectly. See, I'm, um, I'm clever like that. Okay, we are already on the program. Everything appears to be set here. I've got everything zeroed. Now it's just a matter of doing it again. So side A is complete and side B is complete. I added a little bit to the back side just like I did with the original door. That way the gear would work out. And I'm pretty much ready to just sand and uh, prime and paint. But wait, then there's this. <laughs> now the circle is complete. Or, or something like that. Um, what was I, what was I talking about? Oh yeah, so the eagle eye will notice that the wood is a little bit lighter than what we just cut. Well, let's just say mistakes were made. And by mistakes, I mean mistakes with my machine. You see, the belts were not tight enough. Observe. If you push down, it should bounce right back up just like that. 
before on my Y axis on both sides, that belt and that one, I would push down and it would just vibrate for a long time, almost like a, like a guitar string, and then finally come to a halt. As a result, I have the world's first Star Wars spoil board, one of a kind. Wasn't really, wasn't really the plan, but you know, I like it. I could say I meant to do that. Um, yeah, don't, I know there's a door over there too. Like I said, mistakes were made. The important fun-filled fact is that this door is just about done. All it needs is some sanding and some priming. Hey, and speaking of sanding, check out this thing. It's a little sander. Isn't that awesome? It's perfect for when I want to sand through grooves and stuff, like, you know, like this door and some upcoming projects and such. So next up is some more sanding, priming, painting, sanding, repeat. So if you like what you've seen, please subscribe, hit the bell, and that way you'll be notified when I put out a new episode. And thanks for watching.